Thank you for listening. Now we shall be talking about conversion from decimal to bicimal. When you have a number in decimal and you want to convert to bicimal, how will you do that? Conversion from decimal to bicimal. So to convert from decimal to bicimal, we have example. Convert the following to bicimal. A. 8.875 So we want to convert this to bicimal B So this is in base 10 We also have 13 point Seven five. So we want to convert these two to bicina. How do we do this? Let's go. Yep. The first one, eight point eight seven five in base ten. So you can separate these into two. We have 8 and 0 0.875. Both are in base 10. So now you can take them from the old part to the decimal part. For the old part, you divide by 2, 2 in 8. Four, remainder zero, two in four, two, remainder zero, two in two, one, remainder zero, two in one, zero, remainder one. So when you move up, your eight in base ten is one zero zero base two. So for the decimal part, you have a 0 0.875. In our primary or elementary mathematics, we can convert this to fraction. This point signifies 1, 0, 0, 0, which is 8, 7, 5 over 1,000. So 875 over 1,000. How do we do this? 5 year 1 in 37. That's 7. 7 times 5, 35. Remain 2. That's 5. 5 year 2, 0, 0. That's 175 over 200. Also, 5 goes 3 times 5, 15. Remain 2. That is 5. 5 goes 4, the 0. That is 35 over 40. So we can still break this down. 5 in 35. That's 7, 5 in 40, that's 8. So we now have 7 over 8. Now, this 7 over 8 is useful because we can express 7 over 8 as 1 
plus 2 plus 3 over 8, which is 1 over 8, plus 2 over 8, plus 3 over 8. We can still break down. We can still break things down from there. Oh, this is 4. Sorry, this is 4. 1 plus 2 plus 4. Yep. So 7 over 8 could be written as 1 over 8 plus 1 over 4 from here plus 1 over 2. This is 2 raised to the power minus 3 plus 2 raised to the power minus 2 plus 2 raised to the power minus 1. So in a nutshell, we can combine these two together to have... So if we should combine these two together, we shall have 8 Point eight seven five base ten will be equals to one zero 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 point one 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 this two. If you can recall in the previous video, this will be minus one, one times two is power minus one, one times two is power minus two, one times two is power minus three, as we have it here. If one of them is missing, zero will represent that position. But because none is missing, we have minus one, minus two, minus three. That's why we have one, one, one. Thanks for listening. Click like, share, and subscribe for the next video. Bye.